Hi guys, I just opened up my computer to check lunch off my to-do list and I literally have 22 tabs open. That's what my brain feels like right now. Anyway, hi if you're new, welcome to my channel or welcome back. Today's video is sponsored by Casetify. I'll be talking about them in one second, but it is a very busy day. It's a busy afternoon. I just cracked all my knuckles, which is what I do when I'm like nervous or stressed. All that aside, this video is a very exciting one because later today I am submitting my very first college applications. I'm finally gonna talk about where I'm applying my application process so far because I've like briefly touched on it and been very vague about it but I'm gonna actually tell you guys all the schools I'm applying to today where I am in the process all that stuff so stay tuned for this vlog it'll be the afternoon I'm also going out of town this weekend so that's gonna be a whole pack with me other video and before I get into all the craziness a moment for our sponsor Tasteify. as you guys know I had a little meltdown about the iPhone 14 if you watched this video you know what I'm talking about we I went to the Apple store got in line and they told me that I needed to have an appointment to shop and so I had a little bit of a meltdown I was planning to get it the day it released but I was not proactive about it I didn't realize that Apple or at least the Apple store by me had shopping appointments only it's the only way you could get into the store so you had an appointment so when I do get the iPhone 14 eventually because I will be getting it because my phone's battery is garbage I'll be getting a case from case to five. They have so many available in their collection of iPhone 14 Pro Max cases I've had this case on my phone for almost a month now. I draw my phone all the time I'm always carrying a bunch of things with me in this case has not failed me my phone does not have a screen protector on it which is like stupidity on my end but she's good as new here's some more close-ups of the designs i ordered you can customize your case and you don't have to stress about your phone being protected Casetify's latest technology ecoshock is embedded in the iphone 14 cases in the impact series with 20 percent increased protection Casetify has a case for everyone they've worked with over 300 artists from around the world to design their cases and they're wireless charging compatible so you don't have to worry about taking off your case if you want to charge your phone wirelessly and they're sustainable these cases are made with 65% I dropped it recyclable recycled and plant-based materials case defy is perfect for me because my phone goes with me absolutely everywhere like I don't go anywhere without my phone and I know that's the case for most people so it's so important to invest in a good case that will protect your phone that's practical and it's trendy here's that other case on my phone I'm gonna switch it out honestly right now I'm just gonna leave this one on my sister Allie has the same one in lime green so we can match I'm gonna get Allie and we're gonna drop our cases to show you guys how well these things work She's kidding. Allie doesn't want to be in it. She's about well, to take a nap. I, mean, I can be in it, but wait, my wait. credit card information is on this. Oh. I love my case to buy case. Even when I'm napping, it is right by my side. Allie's not going to participate in the drop test, but she approves this message. One of my irrational fears has always been standing over this because the front door is down here and dropping my phone. Now it doesn't have to be irrational anymore. Okay, bye. <laughs> Unscathed. I was propping the camera up with my shoe. Clearly these cases are as good as they say. Whether you're getting a new iPhone 14 or you're just in the market for a new phone case, head to casetify.com slash to shop and get 15% off your order. And don't forget to check out the new iPhone 14 impact cases if you are getting the new phone like me. Eventually I'll get it and I won't have a meltdown about it. I'm sweating right now because I'm in the direct sun. It's Monday, so I had two classes today and two practice this morning. And my battery's flashing. One second. I'm back. Battery's charged and I have a lot of random editing and just project school things to do before I leave this weekend. Like I said, I'm gonna film a pack with me so that'll all be on Wednesday. I have an English project I need to finish because I just don't wanna have to deal with doing schoolwork and doing things on the plane, things like that. I'm gonna be with my family so I just wanna enjoy my time and try to be present and in the moment and not be on my phone or working 24 seven because I just would rather get it out of the way if I can. I'm looking at my to-do list right now. I also want to take Reba for a walk. I've been doing that a lot more recently and I really love it as like a study break or a work break. I'll just go take my dog for a walk around the neighborhood. And it's so great and it makes her so happy. So I recommend, even if you don't have a dog. Ellie Thuman walks like 10 miles a day or something crazy like that. Me and Matt are going to a church worship thing tonight at six, which is in four hours. So I gotta get myself together. And I also have footage that I need to insert from Sydney's birthday party. It was this past weekend, it was on Saturday and it was so much fun. I made a little montage of me getting ready and of the party. So here's that, enjoy. that and I feel like I had something else to say. 
I think you're all caught up. I think that's it. I don't think I can ramble on any more than I already have. I'm gonna crank out this work and I'll update you guys when I take my break to walk the dog. Okay, I'm taking my break. My grandpa's watching TV in there if you hear that, but I have basically everything done for school. I only got to a little bit of editing. It took me like 15 minutes to import everything because I have three hours of footage from these last two videos I need to edit, so that's gonna take me forever. I'm probably gonna have to push it to Thursday and just do it on the plane, which is fine. I'll do it if I need to or just do it Wednesday. I'll probably have plenty of time on Wednesday. I'll just get it all done then. Hopefully I have to get things in. Also, these sunglasses are my new personality. I love them. And I feel very overdressed for this W-A-L-K. She already knows. I can't say it otherwise she'll lose her mind, but I just don't want to take off my jewelry because I'm going to put it right back on later. It's 4.33, so I have like an hour till I'll leave. So I still have a little time to edit when I'm back. And I'm going to listen to the rest of this episode. I never finished from what we said podcast or the morning toast because I haven't listened to this in forever. Reba, do you want to go for a walk? <gasps> yeah. Okay, let's go. Oh wait, hold on. It's way too hot out. It's still like a billion degrees outside every single day. We're out here guys. Hot girl walk. Okay, I'm gonna pray this, this stays here. Hi guys, we are on our way. The camera's shaking but it's 6.08 right now, so we're a little late. We've seen like three accidents, not happen, but just driven by when there's the aftermath of the accident. So that's been kind of scary. I don't think I've ever seen that many in one trip. I didn't get a chance to show you guys my outfit, but I'm wearing this new top that I got from Princess Polly and then jeans and the forces. And I'll talk to you guys when we get there. I might be able to record stuff. Maybe I won't, we'll see. We don't really know what it is. We're just along for the ride. I don't know what to expect. Probably gonna be fun, cause Jesus. <laughs> what is that smile? Okay, we're gonna get food after. The Chargers lost by 21. We both haven't eaten dinner. To the but... Jags. I don't want to be a Chargers fan anymore. <laughs> Comment down below who I should be a fan of now, guys. I quit. I quit being a Chargers fan. Guys, update. We're at in and out It was ending. We left a little bit early because it was three hours long, which I was not expecting. I didn't realize it was gonna be that long. Uh, we're getting food at in and out right now, and it's almost nine o'clock. Lauren's here, Trey's still at the church. So is Hope, I don't know why he's singing his <laughs> southern accent. You wanna talk to them? Yeah, sure. Hi guys, I'm Lauren. Well, I'm going to Clemson on Wednesday with Jackson. South Carolina. She's South Carolina. dating Jackson. I don't yeah. know if Jackson has been in the vlog. He actually has, oh, I was watching them the other day. Just kidding, Jackson's been in the vlog. Yeah. Just Jackson's girlfriend. Bye. Oh my gosh, guys. I'm trying to set this so it'll stay. It is a green light. Hold on. This is... Okay, I just pulled into the school parking lot. I moved my car for better lighting because the sun is hitting like every car in a weird way. Anyway, it is 7.30 something right now and I am struggling today. This vlog wasn't supposed to continue into today, but here we are. That's fine. I got home last night and I went straight to my room, sat in my bed with my computer to work and I fell asleep like instantly in my jeans with all the lights on and all my makeup on and I didn't wake up until the morning and thank God my phone had like the littlest battery life left. It didn't charge. It only had 1% and the alarm went off for like 10 seconds and then it just stopped because my phone died. I don't even have my shoes on but we're gonna try to turn this day around because it was a rough morning. I was not like happy with myself that I slept in my, just you know that feeling when you're so uncomfortable, like you just know you didn't get a good night's sleep. That's how I felt. So it's gonna be a great day. I didn't get to submitting any of the applications obviously because that's what I got in my bed to work on and then I just fell asleep. So I am gonna do that today. I still wanna include that in this video. Grace is gonna be here any minute to pick me up so I don't have to walk over. And I have a bar in my backpack to eat for breakfast. So I'll keep you guys updated. I'm gonna go to a coffee shop after school and work because that really is honestly where I get the most work done. And I know I'll have more homework to do today and all the finishing touches for like college application stuff. My first class is SLT, thank goodness. It's not really academic based. I will update you guys hopefully soon. My saving grace. Has right, my saving grace literally. And Harry. And Harry always. I think we should make an appearance of Harry every Grace time and I fun. were talking about screen. Um, how we literally like not a day goes by these days that we're not tired. Is this what the rest of our adult lives will be like? I can swear. <laughs> I can't. It's just because we had to wake up so early yesterday and having it on a Monday is not the vibe. It just starts off the week. On, I should have gone like, You're already night. exhausted. But we don't like Cammy and Kaylee went to that Morgan Wallen concert and they and then Kaylee slept like two hours. <sighs> anyway, I want Starbucks. Can you ask the lines? Yeah. Say Grace wants it too. What are the chances she actually gets it for us? I asked, maybe she will. Update, Matt is taking me back to my car because <sighs> classes are over. He used to go to baseball and I'm gonna go get all my work done. My hair is in shambles right now, but we had Club Rush. Thank you. 
you. Yeah. I'll insert, it just is really loose. I'll insert some clips from Club Rush, because we had that. Sydney has a club, Chloe has a club, Kira has a club. I think that's all for now. I'll probably just insert a time lapse of me working away because you don't want to hear me talking about it any more than I already have. Bye. It is 6.44, which means I was there for like five and a half hours. My mom has sent me to pick up Mexican food for dinner, so I'm gonna do that on my way home and then the moment you've been waiting for. My call job because you speak the devil. She's calling. Uh, it's Andrew Katie. Okay, I'm home. Obviously, it's pitch black dark outside, so the lighting is coming from my bathroom. I just had to restart my camera because it keeps shutting off, so if I cut in and out, bear with me. I'm applying to all of these schools. Arizona State, Florida State, the University of Tennessee, University of Colorado Boulder, University of North Carolina at Chapel Hill, SDSU, and Boise State. So I'm really all across the board in terms of location with my colleges and... It makes me nervous. Every day that goes by, I like worry more and more. Like, am I making the right decision? Is it gonna be too far? Am I not gonna like it? But what brings me peace is that I know there is only one plan for me. Like in this dashboard right here, I see all these colleges. I'm in the Common App and there's the ASU Katie, there's the Florida State Katie, there's the Tennessee Katie, Colorado, so on and so forth. But at the end of the day, I know that God already knows where I'm going. Like he already knows the plan for my life. So that brings me a lot of peace in this process. So tonight I'm submitting my application to Boise State which I basically had done. I just have to press a button because it's very simple. Florida State and Arizona State. Almost every single school has different requirements. And there's the Common App, which a lot of schools you apply through and others like Boise State is just directly through their website. SDSU is through the CSU application, which isn't even open yet. Allie already submitted all of her applications because she's crazy. I did submit all my applications. I've gotten into two schools. They also all have different deadlines, so I'm not doing mine in order, which I should be, but I'm gonna have all of them done before the first deadline anyway, so might as well. Okay, let's do this. I'm hitting submit on Boise State. I really don't think I'll go to Boise State. It's not in my top five, but I'm still applying there. Okay, one done. I cannot believe it. Like, this is figuring out where I'll be for the majority of the next four years. I ventured to my mother's room, and Reem is over there too. It's getting really late. It's been a while since I talked to you guys. I ate home, er, I got home and I ate, and then I was watching some Virgin River, and then I decided to get my butt in gear and do this Why stuff. I'm not having reviews right now. Because I just want to, another set of eyes to double check like, that I, I We already right. did all this before. Okay. Mom, I did it. It gives me confetti. My camera has failed me. It's just stopping. I need to reformat the card. That's what happened last time. It gives me this little alert message at the top. I don't know why it happens, but it does. But when I reformat the card, everything deletes on the camera. So I just need to import all my footage so I have it ready to go. Anyway, I am calling it quits for the night. I'm clocking out. I am a tired girl, very ready for bed. I have to be up at five something tomorrow for cheer practice. And then four something, it might be earlier than four. I don't know, Um, for the flight on Thursday. Sorry, the lighting is incredible subpar i will continue the application process throughout my videos so stay tuned if you're new be sure to subscribe go follow me on instagram tiktok pinterest thank you guys for watching this video even though it was a little bit all over the place it was abnormal but also kind of normal the last two days i love you guys hope you have a wonderful week i'm seeing so many people panicking on social media about the hurricane and i see so many people posting about it i've seen tiktoks things like that so if you are in its path or you had to evacuate or anything like that, I'm praying for you. I'm also praying for the countries like Cuba and Puerto Rico. I'm praying and would love to help out in any ways that I can. So if you have any resources that you know of, please leave them in the comment section. Have a wonderful day, night, morning, wherever it is, wherever you are. Love you. Bye.